Hi Air Signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to your weekly tarot reading. This can be applicable if you do identify as a Gemini, Aquarius or a Libra. Uh, and we'll see what the cards are for you this coming week. So don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Um, otherwise, let's give the cards a good shuffle and see what is coming up for you for the week ahead. What are the messages for you? First, let's have a look at the overall energy, the theme for you this week. Okay, Page of Pentacles, all about new distractions, things keeping you busy. There's a lot of attention or focus. So your attention is about to shift in a very powerful way here. Um, someone is going to have your attention or something is going to have your attention. Now, it also symbolized something becoming very important to you this week. Notice how the Page of Pentacles Pentacles is holding it so delicately and he can't take his eyes off it. So I think there is something very, um, very major that's going to um, somehow be or have your attention this, this week. Okay. Okay, seeing these cards here come up, you've got the world card, okay, you've got the magician, so you're in a very independent or entrepreneurial energy this week, okay, it could indicate um, coming into single life, it could indicate starting a new project, a new job, um, the magician gets things done and he's, here, he's in a very powerful manifesting energy, so straight away I feel like a lot of you, th there's new beginnings here, this is a very transitional week, um, and you're trying to get your focus back or you're trying to focus or to understand something perhaps especially if you're walking away for some of you there might be a relationship that's ending um, a friendship that's perhaps been in turmoil um, sort of walking away or distancing yourself especially distancing yourself mentally um, what I get from this is that you're trying to distract yourself, okay? The world card is all about opportunities, online connections. It can rule things like travel, um, getting out there into the world, um, maybe creating a name for yourself even. I think the focus and the attention for you this week is like you needing to be independent or you needing to focus on your own, um, on your own um, sort of yourself uh, but I do want to say there is there is an important relationship around you you've got the four of wands which is seen as the marriage card the engagement card uh, so for some of you there's like an engagement with someone that's very special to you or maybe this is someone you're married to or someone you hope you would get married to there is a connection that's here um, but there's either loss of this connection so walking away altogether uh, and hence why, you know, you're in this magician energy. The magician acts very impulsively though. And I feel like whatever is going to have your attention or whoever is going to have your attention uh, with the page of pentacles, you're going to be so immersed in this, in this kind of energy. Um, now it could be something new for some of you, a new love or a new romance could be on the cards here and it's going to take up a lot of your time. It's, it's that happy phase, you know, you're connecting with this person, you're getting to know each other, it's exciting, it's mysterious. So some of you are on that path. Um, for others, this, this, this page of pentacles is telling me he's trying to distract himself from what's happened here with the five of swords. So you find yourself in this energy where you don't want to think about the pain or you don't want to think about the heartbreak, um, but he's still looking back. So I get the sense that some of you are trying to like reflect or understand what went wrong in a connection. Um, the world card is also about understanding. It's about uh, shifting your awareness and looking at things from a different angle. And you might seek the help of someone um, to better understand what happened in a certain situation or what is happening in a certain situation and yet you'll find yourself in in this um in this energy but the magician is is quite powerful and he gets things done so if you're wanting closure or if you're wanting understanding in a situation you'll get it okay you've got the power to attract it you've got you've got the thought and you've got the energy next to you here um but I feel like there could be distractions with maybe like going out as well. Four of Wands is like events and, and things happening could even be dates. There could even be a new online connection for a lot of you watching. Um, 
So that could be quite exciting here as well. Um, but the Page of Pentacles tells me something. It's in its early stages because pages are seen as young, inexperienced, youthful. They're, then they don't know what's ahead just yet. So I get there's a lot of newness coming in in this week and you're trying to adjust to it, okay? A new relationship status, um, adjusting to not having someone in your life, you know, not speaking to them every day, um, maybe adjusting to a new study schedule or a new job. It's almost like you're trying to adapt to a new way of life and, you know, that can pose some difficulties and at times you'll find yourself thinking back to what went wrong, thinking back at what you could have done, thinking back, trying to understand it. For some of you, it's with a third party situation. There's someone else, another person that somehow impacted your connection, your your love relationship or your marriage. Um, and it could even be someone that you stumbled across online uh, or something may have happened where another person was involved and it caused a bit of an uproar or it caused... It caused something. It maybe opened your eyes, okay, to what's really going on in your connection and to the person that maybe you're really with. So um, it, it's put everything out there on the table, okay? And the, the magician can be like things that were hidden or kept from you uh, because he's, he's sometimes known as the manipulator, okay, because he changes the way we see things for his benefit. So for some of you, there's this realization maybe that's coming this week that not all was what it seems, okay? Or the person that you were with is not what they were portraying themselves to be. So there could be some disingenuine factors that, that came to light here. Remember, the world is about exposure. Um, that became exposed, that came to light. And I think you're seeing it. But I think for some of you, it's going to cause you to walk away. If you do walk away, you've got a lot of new things coming in, like I said, with the Page of Pentacles, because that's your overall energy. So straight away, that's telling us there's new new ways of looking at things, new peoples, new, uh, new connections, new love fantasies. All of that sort of newness that's coming in around you is going to take up a lot of your attention. And it's just how you are, air signs. Well, I should say just how we are. You know, when something new comes in and, and something gets our attention and if we're in that high energy um, where it's all about ourselves and we're changing our look and we're improving our appearance and we're going to the gym and we're doing all these sorts of things um, for ourselves, then it's really like, it's a really powerful energy and some of you need to step into that. And that's okay if sometimes you find yourself wondering about the past or wondering about an ex or wondering about how things went wrong. Know that's part of the healing process and know that's part of, it's part of what you need to do essentially um, to move forward and to move to new beginnings. Okay, so um, I'll leave your weekly reading at that. So thank you again for watching. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And I'm sure I'll catch you very soon. So take care, air signs and bye for now.